Seven days. Hello and welcome to day 16 of my solo Seven Days to Die um, gameplay. Um, quick catch up, we have two forges, one purely dedicated to good old cement coming through. Um, as you can see we've got some bits in there, I'll give that some more wood I think. Have that constantly going. Um, it's making a nice bit of cement. We've got enough crushed sand to do some more. And in this one, obviously, iron, lead, brass, whatnot. Um, we do have some food down stairs because we did do a nice bit of um, hunting for some eggs and meat and, and whatnot um, and we, we're basically just going to carry on on the, the base um, so we've dug out a perimeter tunnel and pretty much all we've been doing is digging as far up as we can go all the way around and we'll be doing the same throughout all of this bit obviously all of that is going to be turned into concrete so we can make our base so um I hope you enjoy. Um, yeah. Um, right. Guys, we have hit a milestone. We are level 40. I have been saving my points. I'm hoping we have enough. Steel smithing requires tool smithing 6. 12 points. 15 points. I have 40 points. So, bye. Thank you. Crucible. You see her? Yeah. Clank parts ten. What do I need? Yep. Forged iron. On its way. Alright, well, that's on its way. Let's go and get the airdrop. In case, no, my luck. Nobody? Nobody? No. It's glitched. Damn you.
Well, semi wasted trick. Did kill two deers to find three eggs. Okay. Let me check that in just a second. Eight meat, three eggs. Other random stuff. Thinking you are. Seventeen. Doesn't matter. I really don't want to make any more iron again.
Okay, finally we have a crucible, which is a crucial part of what we need. So, we can put that in there, which unlocks that. We can make 600 of them. Let's not get greedy. Let's make 200 of them. <laughs> Come on! One forge steel. Let's just watch this right now. Twenty. Right, um, we survived another day um, down in our massive pit. We have hollowed out a bit and we reached the fabled level 40. Yes, a milestone was hit. We can now make steel. So, we have a new wrench. 
will be scrapping that. We have a new axe. We'll be scrapping that. Um, we will be making a shovel. This needs some more steel. And I'll just scrap that myself. So, um, yeah, we're off to a pretty good start. Small iron in there, that's still making stuff like that. Getting rid of the lead. Got sand in there, we've got plenty of stained cement. Oh, lovely. More cement, more sand. Lots of stuff in the queue. Fuck it, put you up there. Right. And that supply drop is lying to me, it does not exist. Anyway, screw it. Right. Uh, was that that sawmill? Because I almost fell off a cliff somewhere that could have been. I don't know. Anyway, look at that another time. Um, I'm going to call it here. I'm. Well, I, I hope you can see what I'm, I'm doing. Um, it's going to be obviously outer wall. Uh, we're going to be the third on the third block up, so I can walk underneath it, do all the electrics and whatnot. Um, this is going to go all the way up to the service, with of course the ladder all the way up there, and there's going to be a stairwell going up all the way around this, spiraling up all the way to the surface as well. And of course we've marked out the surface area. Um, so it's all good. So um, if you enjoyed, please like the video. I'd be very much grateful. Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe, leave a comment. Um, good, bad or ugly, I don't mind either way. Um, but I hope you have a good one. And I hope to see you next time. Cheers. Bye.